Welcome to Tractor DJ. In this series of videos, we'll show you how to get started with Tractor DJ. We'll start by learning about how to browse, load, play, and navigate your tracks. To find your tracks, you'll need to open the browser. Just swipe up the screen like so. With the collection menu, you can access your tracks pre-sorted by songs, playlists, artists, albums, or genres. After selecting a playlist, you'll see all its tracks listed on the right side. Sort the tracks according to the icons either by name, album, artist, key, or BPM value. As soon as the app is started, Tractor will start to analyze every track on your iPad in the background and detect its key and tempo. This is why you can see these values listed here already. Scrolling is like any other touch device. Simply drag the track list up or down. To scroll through large lists faster, Directly grab the scroll bar on the right side and move it up or down. Alternatively, you can also use the search field to search for specific tracks or artists. Now that we've chosen a track, we can load it into one of the decks. It's really easy. Just touch the track and move the load slider up to deck A or down to deck B. Once a track is loaded, simply press the play button and you're off. One of Tractor DJ's most powerful features is its recommendation engine. This great tool analyzes your collection and recommends tracks that mix well with the song you're playing. Tap the album artwork of the deck you want to load to. The browser opens and you can see the list of recommended tracks on the focus pane. The tracks are recommended by matching tempos and keys, which Tractor has detected in the background already. A green icon suggests that key or tempo value, or both, will work well together with the track already playing. Just use the load slider again to load up the chosen track. If you want to change the tempo of your playing tracks, tap on the Master BPM to open the tempo wheel. Turn the wheel to adjust the tempo smoothly. When you want to quickly jump to another part of a playing song, pick up the red Waveform window and drag it to a new position on the track. Let go and choose the beat on the waveform you'd like to jump to. Tractor DJ will jump there in perfect time and your track keeps playing from this position. Since we're already talking about waveforms, try to grab the red waveform window on the stripe with two fingers. When you start to pinch in or out, you can change the waveform zoom level. Now you know the Tractor DJ basics. Here's one last tip to find your tracks easier and keep them well organized by sorting them in playlists. Choose the songs you'd like to copy to another playlist by tapping the edit button within the browser's track list. You'll see a tick that can be checked. Check the tick next to the songs which should go into your new playlist and then tap the Add to Playlist button. Choose the playlist you want to add the selected songs to or create a new one. If you want to learn more about Tractor DJ, make sure to watch our other tutorial videos. Also, check out Tractor DJ's amazing Notification Center, which provides step-by-step -step instructions for Tractor DJ's most important features.